The WordPress page content type with its parent-child hierarchy helps the system function as a content management system. Its built-in tools for managing this parent-child relationship, though, are difficult to use when sites have more than uh, 30 pages or so. Well, the right page order management plugin will help you save time and keep your site organized the way you want. I've got a recommendation for you. WordPress built-in pages list does a decent job of showing the parent-child relationship between pages. Top level pages are just sitting here normally. Their children pages, second level pages, are indented to the right with a dash, one dash, to the left. Then what I'd call third level pages are indented even further with a couple dashes and so forth. It's pretty easy to see which pages belong where. When you need to move pages around in the page hierarchy, things start to get interesting. If I need to change the parent of this page, I can go to Quick Edit and find the correct parent right here from this drop-down. But can you imagine what happens if a site is managing hundreds or maybe even thousands of pages? That's going to get impractical very quickly. The same thing happens if I enter the Edit Page screen for that page. I still have this pop-up which is my only way to determine what the page's parent is. Sometimes you just need to change the order in which pages appear. That sounds rather simple. I can go to Quick Edit, change the order number here, but it's not very intuitive as to where different pages appear in the site. The same thing goes for the Edit Page screen. Again, I can simply change this number, but on a complex site, I may not really understand where that page will end up. I recommend the Pages Tree View plugin to improve all that and more. Here in Pages Tree View, we first see all the top level pages. Any pages scheduled for future publishing are marked. Any with pending status or draft status are also made apparent. If any page here serves as a parent page to others, there's a disclosure triangle out to the left and a number to the right indicating how many children it has. Click the disclosure triangle to see those children and the tree moves on. To relocate a page anywhere in the hierarchy, I simply click and drag it to its new location. In Pages Tree View, when we mouse over a page, a toolbox appears allowing us to edit that page or view that page in the front end. We can also add a new page relative to this page. If we click After, we'll add a new page directly after Mission Statement here in the hierarchy at the same level. If we click Inside, we'll add a new page that's a child of the mission statement page. Well, no plugin is perfect for everyone, after using Pages Tree View for a few years, I have some recommendations for improvement. First of all, these small icons can be difficult to handle for some folks. Indeed, if I click and drag, trying to target the new location for my page can be a real pain. Along the same lines, these disclosure triangles are just too small for some people to manage. Providing an option to use larger icons and a bigger type size would help with these issues. Using these pop-up toolboxes can be difficult. If we don't move straight into the toolbox the right way, we end up opening the toolbox for the page below it. It would be nice if we could somehow click the title of a page then it would open the toolbox permanently until we click one of these links or a cancel button. I've used Pages Tree View on sites with more than 800 pages, some stored four and five levels deep. I can tell you that makes this tree view pretty hairy since I can't limit the number of pages that show up at any one time. There's got to be a better way to handle that on sites with a large number of pages. All told, the CMS Tree Page View plugin is a great tool that can help most people that work with a lot of pages on their WordPress site.